so guys don't mind my hair i need to go to the barber and shave or have my hubby shave me because i cannot do anything for myself <laughs> when it comes to hair that is um i met someone here who likes to disturb me say hi Hi. So, I actually want to do a quick video about um schools in America. And I mean, we we know how schools can be tricky in terms of like how kids have been given so much power in schools. You hear all the kind of things that kids are taught in some schools, and it kind of worried me, you know. Um so when our 3-year-old finally started school, um, you know, uh last month, I was very keen to like study the school because it's all about application. It's not like every school is going to is going to accept you guys. So really, you're left with very little choices. It's not honestly for you to choose. It's actually the school that accepts your application, the one that had openings. So this particular school that accepted our son, um, I've been trying to like study them and I actually noticed they're Christians, but I did not think it's like very serious until so we like to pray before we eat so we've taught our son how to pray before we eat so i mean he's three so even when you tell him yeah let's pray for the food he's going to go like no 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 like he won't be saying but he's he's saying something so we'll let's just you know i encourage him and we're like yeah amen so when he started yes. going to school it's now like a month late let's say he just finished like i think a month yeah so when um now we tell him to pray he actually says a prayer that they learned from school and i was impressed i was like what is he saying it was something different you know i it made a lot of sense that what he was used to saying and so my husband actually told me what you know what what it is the prayer because that's the same prayer that they used to pray when they were uh, growing up when he was in school so how do you pray for the food how do you pray for the food yeah you pray for the food solo Solo and then you pray. I want you to pray for the food. Is it good? Okay, I want you to pray for the food. Come, come and pray for the food. Tell them how you pray for the food when you're in school. No, not show. Show them how you pray for the food. Swallow your food and then say, how do you pray? God is good. Mm -hmm. Pray. God is good. God is fun. When is it for all food? Amen. Amen. So that's what he used to say. And I was like, what is that? So I asked, and knew my husband was like, that, that's a prayer. You know, it's, it's, a, it's a prayer that we say when you're praying for food there. In school, we used to say the same prayer. So it's God yeah. is, God is, uh -huh, say it. God is good. Uh -huh. God, God is, is good. great. Let's thank, eh? let us thank him for our food. Amen. Yay, clap for yourself. <laughs> so when I heard that as a parent, I was so impressed. I was like, yeah, this is truly a Christian school. They teach a child how to pray for their food, you know. I was really, really happy. And so I'm hoping, you know, that that ensures, it, it takes some worry off my mind that they'll not be teaching my children you know, all the creepy things that we've heard about, you know, uh, on the internet. Yeah, so I was really, really, really impressed. So